Hello, Midwest Fun Page. It is a beautiful Saturday in St. Louis, and it's a busy Saturday down here. Today, we're starting the day with a Cardinals game. Then at 2 p.m. at the Dome, we'll all be cacawing in St. Louis and rooting on the Battle Hawks. And at 7.30 tonight, behind me, the St. Louis SC will hopefully win. But first, let's head on down the street to Chili Max and fill our bellies with some delicious breakfast. Normally Chili Max is only open on weekdays, but sometimes they're open on Saturdays if it's a game day. So we're really excited to get to have breakfast at one of our favorite spots. Yes, we are. So we're back at Chili Max and we order something different. I usually get the sausage and today we ordered sausage, egg, and cheese breakfast sandwiches. And Jim got a side of potatoes. There's side of potatoes for me. Should be good. Yes. Now we're just waiting for the food. By the way, this place is more packed than usual. Do you agree? Well, we were able to sit down immediately, though. There was one Saturday when there was a Cardinals game that we were going to come here, and the line was super far out the door. So, it's, I don't know. It stays pretty busy, I think. It's good to see them getting lots of business. Absolutely. We want it to be busy. Yeah, we want, we want it to be busy. We, we wish the city would be more. We're hopeful that one day it is. Hopefully, busier. one day. It, it would be like busier. days like today, where there's a lot going on. Hopefully, we see a lot of people downtown and a lot of businesses get business. So, what ride do you want to go on next? Um, the Kaka ride. The Kaka ride. You don't want to go on the log flume? Actually, this would be a pretty good day for the log it, it, it would be a great day for the log flume. It's warm enough without being sweltering. Hopefully the Thunder River is over this week. They said late May though, and it's still, it's only uh, the 4th. So, it's it's still pretty early. Oh, May the 4th but be with you. do I believe any of the signs that are in front of? So what ride do you want to go on first? The Kaka ride. Kaka ride. Okay, I can... Is that... No, is it... Is that the name of the Joker? Sure. Okay. Oh, no, they're going to retheme the Buccaneer to the Kaka ride. Just retheme it every year. Yeah, they should retheme the, re that thing every year. It really is cool to see it back as the Buccaneer, though, because of the nostalgia. Yeah. It's, it's the same ride without... Without the Joker, Big Joker on head on it. It's such a fun ride, like, and it's, it's such a good ride to like get kids acclimated to riding. But in in my forties, I still think it's fun. Yeah, it's not too intense. Yeah, it's a nice break ride. Like, right. but if you sit in the way back, like, you do get a little bit of a thrill. Right. I like it a lot. I like it a lot too. Do you know what we haven't been on yet this year? What? We haven't been on Joe's favorite ride. First aid. No, not uh, the first aid tent. <laughs> That's what you always say. That. <laughs> no, Joe's favorite ride is the Colossus. Oh, right, Joe? I haven't been on the Colossus yet. Joe's a little hangry. He hasn't had food yet. <laughs> Maybe he'll get a little more lively in a little bit. Maybe we'll, we'll get some words out of him. <laughs> well, it looks like the food's almost going to be here. But while we're waiting for our food, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell and choose and share it with your friends. Share it with your friends. Like put it on your Facebook. Tell a friend. We need more subscribers. It'd be awesome if you joined us and you're able to come share to the love. come to Six Flags with us. Uh, watch us review moose burger <laughs> today we're at moose burger we still need to try the new chicken sandwich that's right that's what we should do next chicken sandwich because i tried the mac and cheese oh mac and cheese can use a little bit of work i'm i'm, I'm not gonna say you know mac and cheese is hard 
because everyone likes it differently. Yeah. And everyone makes it so differently, it's hard to go out and order it. It is. Maybe they put a little more meat. Hey, did you eat all the meat on that? Thing? I did. The meat was really oh, good. Oh, that's what it was. The meat, the brisket was delicious. She ate all the protein on. Yeah. On and in. I just ate a couple bites of the mac and cheese. I just, I don't know. It was really bland. Yeah. Who horrible. doesn't like mac and cheese? But, um, I mean, I like mac and cheese, but if it's bland. I just realized this is the first time we've ever like sat down at a table. We usually sit at the booths. If you've, you've ever been in here or to Chili Max, they have uh, bar seating and they have oh they have counter seating and they have tables. But most of the time it's just me and Heather. But today we got Joe and he's had his orange juice and he's awake now. Hello. I haven't added any caffeine yet, but I'm I've been awake long enough to be awake, so yay! <laughs> Joe's got an appropriate shirt on because today we're going to the Battle Hawks game. We gotta get to the stadium early because Ticketmaster screwed up my tickets. And they have to print them off. And hopefully they don't give me the rest of the tickets for the rest of the season. That stink is on that. I have to carry them around the dome with me. But we're gonna go to the ticket window and figure out what's going on. Hopefully, hopefully everything will go smoothly. If not, we're gonna be watching the game on TV or else buying buying tickets to get in. Uh, I got scrambled eggs and bacon. And ma'am, and potatoes. Yep. Another guy. I got sausage, egg, and cheese on white bread. I got the same thing. What I got. I got taters. Let's dig in. Taters. So we got two empty plates except for this piece of toast that we'll be eating before we leave. Trust me, I can guarantee that. Wonder Bread is the best. Yeah. So Joe's still eating his food. I'm pretty sure, because I've had that dish before, and I know Joe's got his mouth full. He's just going to nod his head. Isn't that awesome? It's really good. It's really good. Oh, he's talking. But hey, you gotta take on that toast. <laughs> I don't think it's a competition. I'm, jo I'm just joking. My food was amazing. Thanks How was your sandwich? I liked it a lot. I would definitely get it again. Absolutely. Yeah, well. Sometimes the basics are the best, and I feel like that's kind of how breakfast food is in general. Right. All right, well, let's go. So, like Heather said in the beginning of the video, there is a lot of games going on today. I just found out we're playing against the White Sox today. That's my other team. Because uh, I, I got an American League team and a, a national team. I Who's, think you have more White Sox clothes than you have. <laughs> yeah, I'm more White Sox stuff than uh, Cardinal stuff. We but need, you like the black and white a lot. I like the black and white. Uh, but I really hope it's a really good game. And I hope my my favorite team wins. Yeah, you're good either way. Either way, I'll be happy. So who is City FC playing? Some team needs to be on. That's right. Hopefully we're gonna see a good game tonight at or today at the dome. Battle Hawks are going to play against the Rough, Roughnecks, and the Cardinals are going to play against the White Sox. I hope that's a good game, too. No matter the outcome, I'll be happy with that baseball game because I like the Sox and the Cardinals. But the Battle Hawks are undefeated, and we're going to kick their butt today like we've done at home oh they're undefeated at home I'm sorry we've only lost one game hopefully stand out in front of the diner you can see a lot of White Sox fans that are in town or maybe they're from St. Louis and they're White Sox fans which is cool um, they're gonna walk down to the stadium and go see a really good baseball game. No matter who wins, I'll be happy. 
But tonight, we're gonna, or today, we're gonna beat the Roughnecks and continue our undefeated streak at the Dome. I know we lost one game, but that was on the road. They're undefeated at home. We just had a delicious breakfast at Chili Max. We shared a table with two really nice Chicagoans and influenced them to try their very first slingers. Hopefully they enjoyed them because we headed out before they did. And now let's head to the Battle Dome. Kaka! Kaka! Well, we are down at the Dome early. Would you say we're here early? Look around, this is the tailgating spot and there's only a few people who are here yet. That's how you know we're early. That's right. We're gonna go deal with the master of tickets because it somehow my season tickets got screwed up. What did I step on? I don't know what that was, but we're gonna go deal with the ticket master at the ticket booth. That's where we're going to meet the okay. master of tickets. Fingers crossed it all goes well and fast and easily. Yes, hopefully. Didn't Metallica have a song about them? Yes, master of tickets. Are... <laughs> master, master. <laughs> but you gotta cross over here. Here we go. So the box office doesn't open till 11. We went over there and it was not open. It's about 10.30. So we're gonna check out the merch tent. Make sure you guys like and subscribe because this is the end of this video. On Wednesday, we're gonna put out the Battlehawks game video. But make sure you like and subscribe and ring that notification bell. Heather, why do you gotta ring that notification bell? So that YouTube can tell you every single time we post a video or go live. So we're gonna find out, did Jim get his season tickets? Did Man, they, I hope so. Did they figure it out? <laughs> or am I gonna be watching the game at home on Channel 30? Or what is it on, ESPN or Channel 30? I don't remember. Or Fox, I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna find out where the game is. Hopefully not. Hopefully we'll be in our seats. <laughs> hopefully it won't matter. Hopefully, yeah, hopefully it won't matter. But the ticket window is gonna open up in just a little bit. Right about 11 minutes. Right, yeah. No, I just decided I wanted to wait until it's Let's see if this guy can get his guitar into the dome. What do you think? I'm gonna guess it's four something. Make sure you like and subscribe. <laughs> You're gonna find out on the next video. He's going in. Let's see if security lets him. We'll see you next time. See you on Wednesday, right? See you on Wednesday. So the Bad Hawks do something really cool. The team comes in to the dome as a team. They get off their bus across the street and they walk towards the dome. Yeah, baby! Here comes the team. 